Hello everyone and welcome to another Daz tutorial. Um, this one's going to be a quick one, but this is a super useful hack for your uh, for your Daz poses uh, that is going to save you a load of time and trouble. At least it has me, so I uh, hope it does the same thing for you. Be sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you never miss one of my new videos. And also if you like any of the assets that I use, my figure, the dress, hair, any of that, I've got links to them, all of my products in the description below. So feel free to check that out. Um, if you buy any of them using my affiliate link, I get a small commission off of whatever you purchase. It's a great way to support my channel and it doesn't cost you anything extra. So feel free to check that out uh, again if you like the assets that I'm using. All right, so I've already got a very, very basic scene set up. I've got my figure, uh, I've got her dress, she's uh, wearing a dress and hair, and I'm gonna kinda show you the very basics of what we're gonna do. So um, I've got the figure selected, and I'm gonna go ahead and put her in a pose, but a lot of pose packs come with mirrored poses. They're literally just mirror image of, uh, of every single pose in the pack. Uh, for instance, I'll show you one of these in action. Let me try this one right here. So when I do that, this is the pose, and then the one next to it, you'll see it has the same file name, but it has an M after it, which means that it's a mirror pose. So if I double click that, then it does the mirror image of that pose. It just reverses everything. But unfortunately, not all pose packs come with mirror image poses. Or what if you do your own pose uh, from scratch and then want to do a mirror image for that one? I'm gonna show you how to do that. It's actually really, really simple. So I'm gonna go up and select a different pose. This is from a pack that does not have mirror image versions available. So I'm gonna show you how to do one yourself. So let me go ahead and choose the pose that I want. There we go, and all we have to do, first of all, make sure that your figure is still selected. Uh, come over here to the right, and you'll notice this menu up on the uh, up on the top left of that right-hand pane. Um, some people call that a hamburger menu because the lines kind of look like a hamburger. But uh, I'm gonna click that, and we're going to go down to symmetry. We can also uh, do a shortcut for this by hitting Shift and Y, uh, and that'll bring up the symmetry menu. And we're just going to change a couple of uh, a couple of these options. So under nodes, we're going to change that from selected to root. Propagation is none. We're going to select recursive. Direction left to right. We're going to change that to swap left and right. And then finally, under trunk nodes, it says leave alone, and we're going to set that to mirror across y axis. That is literally all you have to do. So once you do that, we're gonna hit the accept button. And boom, after about a second, it flips our pose to the mirror image version. Again, that is all it takes. Super, super simple, but that has saved me a lot of time and effort lately in getting mirror image poses. Um, so again, don't forget to hit the like button while you're here, subscribe to my channel, check out my affiliate links in the description below, and that will do us for this one. Thanks for watching, goodbye.